I'm Rebecca and this is another stop of Tour de Animate. At this stop we also have a new sample for you that you can download and reuse in your own projects. Well, we already know how important it is to use symbols in Animate CC. Today I want to show you how you can create a nested animation by using symbols. This is very interesting because I can create more than one animation at the same time and don't have to redraw the parts without animation for every loop. Let's have a look and animate. As you can see here, our any is split on different layers. And if I do a double click on the head, I get into the symbol editing mode. As you can see here too, all the parts of the head, like the mouth and the nose, are split on several layers too. And if I do a double click on the eye again, I get into the symbol editing mode of the eye. Here you can see also the lash and the eye by itself lay on different layers. Now we want to create the visual effect of a blinking eye. For this I have to open and close the eye several times. So I inserted a few frames and keyframes further down the timeline. So I have to modify each keyframe. To get the effect of a closed eye, I have to drop down the lash a bit, like I did it here, and to fade out the eye. In the next keyframe, I have to create an open eye, so I pasted here the starting position. So I did it again with the closed eye and the open eye. So if I go back, I see my whole character, and if I have a look in the browser, I can see they are running more than one animation at the same time, like the blinking eye, the move of the tail and of the head. So download this recipe for free and reuse it in your own projects. Get inspired by any and bring your own characters to life. Happy animating!